In this video, I will show you five powerful indicators that are better than a regular moving average. These indicators can increase the win rate for any strategy by up to 50%. They're perfect for eliminating losses and making sure you're getting into the trade at the best possible price. I will explain how these tools work and what settings to use for maximum profits, so make sure you listen carefully and take your notes. Okay, without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so in the fifth place, we've got an indicator called CM Ultimate MA Multi Time Frame Indicator by Chris Moody. Let's go ahead and add it to our chart. This indicator right here that's got over 31,000 saves, don't forget to add it to your favorites. So this is basically a colored moving average that changing its color depending on the direction of the price. And the reason this indicator is way better than a regular moving average is because it can filter out some false breakouts. So if the price crosses and closes above or below this indicator, it doesn't mean it will automatically change its color. This way we can eliminate a lot of potential losses and enter the trade at the right price. This indicator also provides so many customization options. For example, the ability to plot the second moving average, the ability to set moving averages to custom chart timeframe, for example, you can set a daily MA on a 60 minute chart. It also provides the ability to plot highlight bars when price crosses first moving average or second MA. You can play around with these settings and choose the perfect ones. For example, let's change the MA length from 20 to 100. And this option from 1 to 4. We can also change the tension factor from 7 to 10. We see right away the signals have become more accurate. This moving average can be used as a first confirmation indicator and the baseline at the same time. You can build a really profitable strategy just by adding some of the top indicators I've already showed you in some of my videos. For example, you can add ADX, QQE mod or normalized MACD. They will all perform really well with this baseline. And to eliminate even more losses, you can add a volume or a volatility indicator to your chart, such as volume or volatility oscillator, volume flow index or regular volume with MA. And the rules for entering trades are simple. You would only go short if the price action is closed below the baseline and the baseline is red color. And exactly opposite would work for long positions. You can set your stop losses at the baseline. I think this method would work just fine. So yeah, let's thank Chris Moody for this amazing indicator. Go ahead and test it out and let us know if you find anything interesting. Okay, now let's move on to the next indicator and that indicator is called Zero Lag SMA. This one by Verifit. I used this indicator in one of my most popular videos on this channel and that strategy showed some absolutely amazing results. Zero Lag SMA gives instant linear regression of current price action. This line works with the same rules as its laggy counterpart, the LSMA. When price crosses over, it signals a bull trend and when price crosses under, it signals bear trend. When price stays close or on a line, sideways action is to be expected. The direction of the line indicates the direction of the trend. First of all, it can be used as a first confirmation indicator. Every time the price crosses and closes above it, you take long positions. And every time the price crosses below it, you take short positions. It also can be used as a baseline so that you only enter long trades if the price is above it. And exactly opposite is true for short trades. And finally, you can use this line as an exit indicator. For example, you don't like the idea of capping your profits. You prefer to let your winners ride and make more money long term. So you manually exit the trade if you have the price crossed and closed above or below this baseline. Right away, we can see it can provide extremely accurate exit signals before the price has a chance to hit your trailing stop loss. You can also change the indicator time frame. We see right away the indicator has improved a lot.
we see all these recent five trades turned out to be successful. Of course, I highly recommend you to add some other indicators to the chart to eliminate losses like these. Those could be different depending on your preferences. But the idea here is basically to find the ones that would prevent us from taking trades when the market is moving sideways so that we minimize our losses as much as we can. Okay, so the indicator number three is called Vidya and it was recommended by VP from No Nonsense Forex. So let's go ahead and add it to our chart. Vidya or Variable Index Dynamic Average by Evergett. This indicator was developed by Tushar Chandey. It's an original method of calculating the exponential moving average with the dynamically changing period of averaging. Period of averaging depends on the market volatility. This indicator can be used as any other moving average to identify and trade trends. Traders often use it in combination with other signals and analysis techniques. It's really similar to CM moving average by Chris Moody. However, it changes color every time the candlestick crosses and closes above or below it. You don't really have a lot of options in terms of changing the inputs. So let's play around and see which one shows the best results. I think anything above 30 would give you late entries. It does issue some false signals sometimes, but again, we can't be using this indicator on its own. So adding such indicators as Chandelier Exit, Super Trend or Trend Meter could be a really good idea. On a second place, we've got a really powerful and profitable indicator I've used in multiple strategies and they all turned out to be extremely successful. This indicator is called Whole Suite. This one by Insilico. The whole moving average is an extremely fast moving average that eliminates lag altogether and improves smoothing at the same time. It generates a trading signal whenever the whole MA crosses above or below its pass to candle value. The rules for entering the trade would be the following. If the price is closed above the whole suite and the line is green, this is a new signal to take a long position. And if the price action is closed below the whole suite and the line is colored in red, this is a signal to go short. I absolutely love this indicator. It's so precise, but you have to adjust the settings, right? For example, you can change the whole variation from HMA to THMA or EHMA. You can also change its length. I personally like to keep it at 200. Changing the length multiplier can also be a good idea. You can also set different timeframes for this indicator and enable color candles based on whole trend. Right away we can see the indicator does not react to the price changes really quickly. I'm not saying these settings are perfect but they worked pretty well in my previous strategies. You can of course change the length from 200 to 60 for example. So right away we can see we have more signals, but again, not all of them are extremely accurate. So I would recommend using this indicator as a second confirmation. For example, you add an indicator like an absolute strength histogram. And if the signal from this indicator is confirmed by the baseline, you can take the trade. We see the signals are really accurate. We had like four really good wins and one small loss, but you can easily eliminate losses like that by adding a volume indicator to your chart. So yeah, the whole suite is definitely legit and I absolutely recommend it. All right, and finally, we've got my number one indicator on a list that is 100% better than a regular moving average. I discovered this indicator not long ago and I had a massive success with it. So the indicator is called Super Ricci. This one by Lux Algo. Using one indicator as the core for another one to improve certain aspects while offering an alternative user interaction can be really interesting in technical analysis. This indicator is a modification of the popular Ichimoku indicator using the equally popular Supertrend indicator as its core, thus no longer entirely relying on calculations done over a fixed window size, but instead relying on the average true range and the trend direction method offered by the Supertrend. The Super Ricci indicator can be interpreted similarly to a regular Ichimoku as it retains the 
the components and aspects from this one. Users can make use of the super trend factor to detect shorter or longer term trends. Unlike the regular components of the Ichimoku based on rolling maximums and minimums, using the super trend here allows smoother components and makes it less prone to whipsaw signals. You can adjust the settings, but I personally like to keep them on a default. We can see right away that this indicator does not react quickly to the price changes, because normally we don't want to be trading in a range in market. But when a price finally starts trending, this indicator issues extremely accurate signals. I made a video this week about the best Ichimoku strategy. In that video, I was using this single indicator and it showed some amazing results. So the trading rules are really simple. You would only be looking to sell if the price is closed below the cloud and the cloud is colored in red. And the orange line has to be above the blue line. This is an ultimate signal that we are officially in a downtrend. Exactly opposite is true for long trades. You would only be looking to buy if the price action is closed above the cloud and the cloud is green and the blue line has to be above the orange line. And the best part about this indicator is that it eliminates so many losses when the market is moving sideways. And this is something you're looking for if you really want to make profits long term. A regular moving average can never provide something like this. So you should definitely consider adding this tool to your favorites and build a strategy that would be constantly bringing you money over and over again. Okay traders, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smash the like button, it really helps with the channel. And also if you want to see more videos like this in the future, then feel free to subscribe to Trade IQ.